everybody, we Rabbit here, and welcome back to our LP of Persona 3 Portable. In the previous part, we did some stuff around town, we joined a club, so we got that social link, and then, you know, they said it was a great idea to come to Tartarus, so everyone's excited to do some training, so I left off where we entered Tartarus, and I said, we will work on that next time, so here we are. Uh, as always, Terrific is here, say hello, Terrific. Yo, what's going on, people? It's your boy, Young Loch Ness Monster, even though I can't swim and I'm not Scottish. It's terrific. <laughs> this is stupid. Okay. Oh, my God. So as we're about to head in, she says, by the way, I found out something else about Tartarus. A few floors up, there's a barricade preventing you from going any higher. The tower seems to have a number of these interspersed among its floors. I know I told you that the layout changes each day, but these barriers seem to be in fixed locations. Therefore, I'd like you to try and reach the first barricade. But don't push yourself too hard. If you go back in from the entrance, you'll be able to resume from the highest floor you previously reached. I'll give you these two just in case. So she has some items to help us? Yeah. If you run into danger, don't hesitate to use them. I'm counting on you. Uh, so this is pretty cool. So basically what it's talking about is that there is, um, for story reasons, there's like a barrier that you can't go past. That way someone doesn't just like do this all in one swoop. Uh, mm -hmm. But even though there's like a barricade, we're going to try to get to at least that barricade before we exit Tartarus at all. Like I'm not going to exit until I, I reach that barricade, basically. That's just like the, the self-imposed little thing I'm doing. You know what I mean? Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So she says, give me a moment and I'll check to see what's beyond this floor. Oh, she's, she's surprised. She says, I detect a great source of power above you. It's still relatively far away, but keep your guard up nonetheless. All right. So that's kind of going to hint at a boss or something, maybe. So, you know. All right. So. Ah, so he attacked us first, unfortunately. I don't think it hurts too much, though. All right. So we're going to, as as you kind of learned, we're going to put back up. We're going to put analyze. We're going to have her analyze this. She's going to take a while doing that. I don't know, maybe we'll kill it before she analyzes it, maybe we won't, we'll see. <laughs> yeah, see, there we go. That's what I'm saying, see how we're already about to kill it and we don't even know what its weakness is? Oh well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, so it's dead. Oh, and it's a shuffle time! Alright, so see how there's no Persona? So there's money and there's health. I am going to go for the money. I'm going to try to build up my money as much as possible before we leave this like, dungeon. So I'm going for the yeah. one on the left. I got it. Nice, huh? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you got some pretty oh. good timing there, man. It says you felt a surge of energy inside after the recent battle. We leveled up. Level four. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, were you able to keep your eye on it? Or like, what, what, what did you think? Uh, yeah, for the most part, I can keep my eye on it. The problem is uh, just hitting the button when it's on the proper side, you know? Oh, well, I mean, it went back to the left side just stayed there. It was just about hitting it when it was on the left side. Well, I mean, but the last one, though, uh, it, it kept moving around. Oh, at yeah. Least so, for... yeah, some of them yeah. keep moving. Some of them, yeah, I get you. So you think you'd have trouble with the timing? Uh, yes. Oh, that's funny. I really but... think so. So this guy's <laughs> stuck. So I'll just poke oh. him in the face. <laughs> Man, you're so right. mean. So we have a new enemy. So let's analyze this guy. Oh, that was a nice attack. Oh, I used ice on Junpei. Oh, she killed it. Perfect. All right, so this is... So this is called a Muttering Tiara, and its weakness is ice and wind. Its strength is fire. So if you use fire against it, it won't hurt it as much. Uh -uh. All right, so we are going to attack this guy. Just fish him off. There we go. Oh, perfect. She got it. There we go. Nice. See, see what I mean? Like, I am not controlling them, and they're doing excellent, so I'm happy. Yeah. All right, it's dead. All right, shuffle time. So I already have the one on the right. So once again, I'm going to go for the money. So mm. it's all around the left. Let's see where it stops. Boom, baby. Got it. Nice. So let's see. So already, remember we had like no money when we came in here? 
We're already up to 1,600, which is pretty good. Uh huh. The money adds up. Oh, we just got another thousand. You saw that? Look at that. Boom. Yeah, yeah. So that's why it's so good to explore because you get all this resources. Alrighty. So if you remember, these guys are weak to fire, so let's attack all three of them with fire. Let's line them up. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to line them up or whatever, like to do the all attack. Oh, he's dead. Ah. Nah, we're stronger, so they're all just dying. That's fine. <laughs> nice. Alright, another shuffle time. Uh, so if you go for the one on the left, that is nothing. That's just like a broken card. You don't get anything, by the way. If we go for the oh, one on the right, really? that's actually really interesting. You get a new weapon. So I'm going to go for the one on the right this time and see if I can get us a new weapon. I think you can do it. Yep. So I obtained Imitation Katana. So remember how I didn't... Oh, he leveled up already. Nice. I was going to say, remember how I didn't um, level... I didn't buy a new weapon for Junpei? Mm -hmm. Luckily, I think the weapon I just got is actually for him. Oh, no, he already has it. Never mind. He already has an Imitation Katana. Never mind. But that's fine. Oh. Since I got an extra one, I can just sell it. So it's still worth it. All right, so we have the stairs. So I don't want to go to the stairs just yet. I want to finish like the whole floor first. All right, so these guys are the ones that she didn't have a chance to analyze, if you remember. Mm -hmm. Let's see if this time I uh, missed. Oh, look, you got like a bonus one. Look at how much points you did. Nice. It seems to have multiple weaknesses. Oh, it's weak against almost everything. It's weak to ice, electricity, wind. Cool. Oh, it knocked her down. Yeah, that thing kind of sucks. Never mind, I got a crit. <laughs> yeah, so you see how it knocked her down? You have to be careful because when they knock um your, the, your people down, they can follow mm -hmm. up with more attacks. So it leaves you Ooh. vulnerable. Oh, yeah. Because it's the same thing if you uh, knock them down. Yeah. yeah so luckily, she was able to get up. <laughs> She's all mad. She's like, you little. <laughs> One enemy oh Pardon. no! Oh, okay. Yeah, see, I got a shuffle time anyway. I thought I wasn't gonna get it, but I got it anyway. So I don't know what the shuffle time. I don't know what makes it come out. <laughs> uh, so that's more money. We have a two and one shot. We have a two and three shot gain money. Got it. There we go. We are moving up with money. Nice. Alrighty. So yeah, a big part of the game. That's what I'm saying. I might do a lot of this stuff off camera after mm -hmm. we finish like a session or whatever a lot of it's just doing this just fighting grinding you know etc it's not yeah. that exciting so that's why i might skip some of this but mm -hmm. for now you know, i'm just kind of showing off the groove of how to how to fight you know how to how to get into it or whatever boom perfect oh there we go all right all right, not bad, not bad. There we go. So we're, we're doing pretty good with our fight so far. Ah, uh, so that, that's the first time we didn't get a shuffle time. See how it, it uh, zoomed in on just Junpei? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is interesting. See how she leveled up? And see how it says next level four, there's like a move under it? So mm -hmm. she's gonna gain a new move. See? Nice, so she gained a new move. So that's really how cool. your teammates also get a bunch of moves and stuff, which is cool. All right. So, so far, not bad. I think we finished this floor. So with that being said, now we'll move up. to the next floor. All right, she says, this whole place is like a maze. Even the access points seem to be randomly distributed. If you feel like you're in danger, don't hesitate to return. So that's the good thing. You can leave whenever you want, but it's obviously let's see, there's one of these things. So that would help us go back to the entrance, but we don't we don't need it. But that's how you uh, explore. You kind of just do things at your own pace, which is nice. Mm -hmm. Now there is a limit to it. Like you do have to like reach a certain part of the dungeon the before the game is over, <laughs> or you like fail. Yeah. But you can still oh. like take it. Like if we wanted to, we could come here like every day and do a floor, for instance, if we really wanted to be that slow. Nice. Something's nice about the game that you can kind of take it at your own pace, you know what I mean? 
Yeah, which is always nice. Like I really do love I really do love games that kind of not reward different play styles, but I guess kind of encourage different play mm -hmm. styles. Yeah, because like, the way I'm gonna do it, like I said, is I want to go all the way to floor 16 before we ever exit here like do it all in one swoop mm -hmm. but yeah if it's like let's say you that maybe you play differently you could just be like oh yeah. i'm gonna do a couple floors then i'm gonna level up some of my friendships then i'll come back you know you can do whatever you want like i just said there's like yeah, so many exactly. ways to do it so oh some new enemies i'd see these guys before so there's some weird hands <laughs> Oh, she's dead. Miss. All right, so these guys. Yeah, so we have we have fire, so we're gonna use fire to get rid of these guys. Yeah, I probably should have paid a little more attention to her. Honestly, I kind of just let her die. Which that was my bad. She'll be fine though. All right, so this time I want experience. Green is experience, so I'm gonna go for experience this time. Perfect, extra experience. Nice. Oh, leveled up again. See how I'm leveled up really quick? So I'm already on level five. Cause you remember how some yeah. of the personas needed to be like level five, level four, etc. Oh, she's just mm -hmm. dead. Oh, poor uh, girl. Do I have anything to bring her back? <laughs> uh. Hmm. I don't really know if I want to use my revival yet. Hmm. I mean, <sighs> hold because, on. Let me uh, see. What? Maybe if I leave and come, maybe if I go back to the entrance, maybe I can revive her that way. Let me just check that out. Yeah, that was my bad. I should have paid way more attention. Hold on. We can always <laughs> come back in, so hold on. Yeah, I think she's fine. Let me see. Hold on. And then, uh, heal party. So it's gonna cost us a bit of money, but that's fine. There we go. Okay, we're all good again. <laughs> yeah, I need to pay more attention. She's our healer, so we don't really want to let her die. So mm -hmm. <laughs> that was my bad. I was just like totally not paying attention. Uh, so resume from third floor. Okay, we'll just start right there. And the only thing is that it's gonna be a different layout from what we just did. Uh, it says, you feel like you've had a few new ideas about fighting. It seems that you'll be able to gain more experience on this floor. Nice. See, as long as they shake things up with, like, what stats you'll come across to. Mm-hmm. All right, cool. Two enemies detected. All right, so these guys were weak against... It seems to have multiple weaknesses. Wind or ice. So I'm going to do something a little interesting. You know how we have multiple personas? Mm-hmm. Uh, let's check out what they have. So that one only has... Dia is a healing. Yeah, Bufu. Bufu's ice. So I'm going to switch to this persona. And now I'm going to use ice attacks. So that's where it's kind of like Pokemon, where you just switch your like, attacks and your, your, po your Pokemon. So that's cool. Yeah, yeah. There you go. See? There you go. Took care of that pretty easy. All right. So I'm going to go for money again. Perfect. All right. Good. All righty. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, there's a golden one. No, I need to get you. I think you have like extra money or something. Come back. No. Ah, <laughs> oh, you bastard. Yeah, I don't think it's worth like extra money or something if I remember. It gives like something special. Ah, oh, see, I suppose they got me. That's lame. Yeah. Yeah, see, we got attacked. Oh, they knocked me down. What? Oh no! We're all down now! Stop it! <laughs> well, uh, what are you gonna do now? Dang, that's, we just got like. See, that's why it's an RPG. Sometimes stuff happens, man. Like, we just got like our ass handed to us right here. <laughs> yeah, you did. Like, luckily we didn't die, but it was just like, okay, we just keep getting attacked, unfortunately. Uh, see, that didn't go too great. <laughs> Plus, you gotta keep yourself awake. I mean, even when you think it's gonna be easy, stuff can happen. Mm-hmm. I uh, got extra experience though, so I was worth it. All right. So Junpei's leveled up. He's gonna gain the fire attack now, watch. 
He, he, Audrey means fire, so he gained the fire attack. So that's pretty cool. So now yeah. um, we're not the only ones that use fire. He can help us out. If there's an enemy that's like, weak to fire, he can help us out to attack. Two enemies detected. Uh, speaking of... Oh, I put it on accident. Whoops. Yeah, I meant to switch Persona and accidentally... It's fine, though. Whatever. All right, all attack. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say emotionless face. I know it's okay. great. <laughs> all right, we're gonna go for the experience again. All right, see, we're blown to experience. Isn't that nice? Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So now she leveled up. So now she gained wind. You know how nobody on our team had wind yet. So that's nice. Mm -hmm. Now she has wind. So she has wind, he has fire. We have uh one with wind one with fire, one with um, ice. So we're getting there, you know. Yeah. Alright, so in order to proceed a little bit farther in the game, I am gonna instead of fighting everything, I will probably do that in my own time. However, I want to at least show more of the actual stuff. Ah oh, dang it. I was trying to just rush by them. Watch I die because of that. <laughs> like, no, it was supposed to go that way. Uh, oh, she's, she's going to kill us. No, she healed herself. Never mind. <laughs> she did not care. She healed herself. <laughs> that was great. No, no, she's fine. There we go. All right. Good job, Junpei. Uh, Junpei was the MVP right there, definitely. Took care of everything. Good job, Junpei. See, I I can't see Junpei with a long like uh, katana like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's so weird because he seems like a goofy character. Uh -oh, so I expect him to have. I, I don't know what weapon I can see him with, but not something as elegant as a katana. You know? <laughs> You're like, nope. Yeah, that it's too good for him. Yeah, I got you. But, like, I mean, he has to use something, right? What else would he use? See, and it's kind of awkward, too, because you're also a sword user. So it'd be interesting if it was, like, sword, bow, and I don't know if he had, like, a lance or something. Damn I don't it. know. Oh, you know what's funny? If you play as the girl MC, you you actually get a lance. Oh, okay. You get, like, a longbow. What do you call those things? It's actually pretty cool. Mm-hmm. All right. So... Here we go, this is what I was going to tell you. So it says, I detect three shadows in this floor central area. They're not like the ones you fought before. If you're not ready to face them, then return to the entrance and reorganize. So every so often, you'll reach a floor where there will be... So we're going to activate this. Anytime you see one of these, that is a mm -hmm. shortcut. That way we can like jump back and forth. Yeah. And then every so often, you will see um, there's bosses. So that's a boss right there. Ooh. So Are you ready for uh, a boss? Uh, probably not. Let me see real quick. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Not right. Not quite. So I'm going to go back to the first floor. All right. She's just talking about how you can use it. I am going to heal us all up. I'll take a little bit more money. That's fine. That's what the money's for. And I'm actually going to see about uh, Prince and Personas together to see if we can uh, upgrade a little bit. Nice. All right, so we still have three, but let's see what we can do. Because uh, we're level five now. So we can make Angel or we can make Nekomata. So let's see. If we make Angel, she has Garu, which is a wind attack. She has Patra, which if an uh, enemy tries to give us fear or distress, we erase it. And she has Bash, which is a strike attack. Hmm. Or we can make... What's the other one? We can make Nekomata. Oh, wrong one. Uh, if we make her, see how it says S-Link will get extra XP? So she'll automatically level up a little bit. And she comes with Fire, a Slash Attack, uh, Healing... 
And because she's gonna level up, she might even come with uh, enraging a foe. So I Let's think I'm gonna make. Oh, what's up? I was gonna say I think you should go with the uh, Necromata. That's probably what I'm gonna go with. Yeah. Uh, real quick though, what's the combination I did? I didn't do this. Uh, see, I didn't do this combination. I did this combination. We'll get this person, which we already have. That's fine. Uh, if we do triangle, we get what do we get for? We can't even do this one because we're not that high let yet. So yeah, so I'm gonna do normal spread, and I'm gonna combine like this. I'm gonna get Nekomata. So I'm gonna do it. All right. Yeah, so he's like transfusing them or whatever. He's using whichever weird old man magic he has. And there she is. I'm Nekomata. I guess I have no choice but to protect you. The classmate hmm. social link infuses Nekomata with power. So she automatically levels up a bit. So she leveled up to level six. She got the move. Cool. There we go. So that's how it works. That's how you get a little bit stronger. You just keep using uh, different monsters and stuff. Now I'm curious, yeah. could we combine these two? We could to get something else, but we're too weak to get it yet. But we could if we wanted to, so. All right. Okay, so I don't know if we're quite strong enough to do the boss. I'm just gonna try it. If we fail, that's fine. I can just level up off screen and then we can try it again later. But for now, I'm gonna go for it. Let me just save real quick. And hopefully with our new persona, maybe we'll be um, fine. We'll have to see. So let's try it. So we're gonna jump up to the fifth floor. All right, and the bosses should be... Oh, wrong way. That's where we entered last time. Because the boss floors are always the same layout, so there we go. All right, we're going to try these guys. Let's go for it. The enemy is stronger this is... than you're accustomed to. Proceed with caution. Yeah, so because they're bosses, they're a little bit harder. So that's why you have to be careful. Mm -hmm. So right off the bat, I'm going to start, as always, by... What are they weak against? Roger. I'll attempt to analyze the mm -hmm. enemy. All right, well, she does that. I mean, I'm going to say lightning and ice. Just because they're birds. This is their birds. Yeah. All right, well, I do that. Uh, let's see. Should I try to do fire? Should I do cleave, which is a stronger attack? Uh, for now, let's just try. Uh, but they're red, though. Because sometimes the, the colors kind of give them away. If they're red, I'm almost afraid they might like be strong in fire. Let's just use cleave. Let's just do extra physical attack on them, sure. Okay. Ooh, that was not bad. All right, so she's going to use wind. Ah, they blocked it. Uh, he's going to use fire. That's Watch these totally screws everything up. Oh, yeah, he healed it. Wow. And he's weak against wind. So. Uh, really? We don't know. There's nothing? No, that's nice. That was weak against? <laughs> we don't know. Great. <laughs> don't wow. You that was mean. And then freaking stupid Junpei just healed it. Oh, there we go. That's nice right there. Ah, oh, I missed the second one. Dang it. That's lame. Uh, I'm guessing she's gonna kill herself. Yeah, of course. Alright, Junpei's gonna get his lazy ass up. So Junpei do not use... There we go. Junpei do not use fire. Alright, so that one got back up. Ooh, I'm pretty weak. Oh, I need to kill myself. Or have her heal me. Okay. Yeah, I need to kill myself. As you can see, they're hard. That's why you have to like really grind up and stuff. Because look at how already they're like really. Uh, so I think she's gonna kill Junpei. So we're all gonna be back to max. Good. All right. So we're will we're literally one of them down. But I don't know. Uh, at some point, can you get? I'm I'm sure you will. But uh, like uh, moves that have an area of effect. Like you target one enemy, and it can do at least partial damage to the other ones. 
Later. It's, it's later. You have to like be like, more yeah, level up. So good. All right, we knocked that guy down. So honestly, I'm just gonna attack him again. All right, and then hopefully she kills me. She killed herself. Probably you not. bitch. You yeah. bitch. <laughs> All right, so what I was saying. I knew it. So luckily they're attacking her, but because wind is her element, it's doing almost no damage to her. Luckily. Oh. Uh, so I am gonna heal myself. There we go. Oh, so that's what they're weak again. See, remember how they didn't tell us? There we go. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So we're not going to, we're probably not going to finish them off because they're too strong. But when you do an all out attack and that gets in, it's really strong. At least you take a chunk of their health. So watch. See, you notice how they get thrown back. Mm -hmm. But at least we did like a little bit of a dent in them, which is nice. And Jupe missed. <laughs> God damn it, Jupe. <laughs> Yeah, see, as long as they attack her with the wind, that's perfect. Mm. All right, so I'm going to do Cleave again, because Cleave at least is really strong. Yeah. And we have to hope that she uses um, her arrows on them. Yes, there we go. Perfect. Good. Perfect. There we go. And then we got to do an another all-out attack. Let's see if we got them back. So we're still not done with them, unfortunately. See, we're getting there. Mm. Right, we're gonna okay, use it against her. Perfect. All right, so we're doing not too bad. Right, I'm gonna use cleave again on this guy. Hopefully, we'll finish him. Perfect. That's two down. Ooh. There we go. All right, let's see if this is enough. Not yet. See how they get thrown back? If they get thrown back, that means that we're not done yet. There we go. Perfect. Nice. We did it. I mean, that was a pretty big challenge for you, though. Yeah. You see how it took a little bit of, like, thinking through and stuff? And, like, you know, that's how it works. A lot of these challenges, the normal battles aren't too bad unless you get unlucky. The big mm -hmm. ones are the ones where you really need to be prepared. Uh, like, I didn't grind just so I could proceed. So I wasn't as strong. Yeah. So I had to like really think about, okay, I need to heal myself and we have to use, you know, uh, the cleave or whatever. And we have to hope that she uses her pierce attack and blah, blah, blah. And, you know, it was a whole thing. Yeah. All right. So we are level six. And if we go over here, there's a special price for us. See, so we got a nice little item. And then we should be able to move up now. There we go. She so says, hold on. The shadows on this floor are a bit different than the ones you fixed as far. Proceed with caution. So we're on level six. And I'm just going to tell you right now, it's kind of a little bit of spoiler, but we want to get all the way to level 16. That's where the barrier is going to be. Mm -hmm. But there should be a boss on... She says it's above us. I think the boss is like on level, I want to say 10. I think it's like on floor 10, so it's still a little bit farther away. But I think this is where we're going to stop again. No. And what I'm going to do is I think between this and the next time we record, I will do a bit of grinding. That way when we go up against the boss on level 10, that'll probably be like the first thing we do. We'll go up against that boss. Um, we will be a bit stronger. And we'll be able to fight the level 10 boss. And then we'll see if we can make it to floor uh, 16. And then after that, that's where we'll proceed. So, you know, okay. but I'm going to do a little bit of grinding off screen and hopefully make those upcoming two bosses a little easier. Are you all, mm -hmm. right? Don't put all right. Cool. I'm trying to see if there's one of those things so I can't. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. So we can just jump back down. That's pretty good. We already made it to level, what was it? I don't know how I'm. This is the one that'll tell us. We made it all the way to level eight. So that's pretty good, I think. Yeah. Nice. All right, so I'm going to save right here. And like I said, off camera, I'm probably going to do some of that grinding and stuff. But next time you guys see us, we will be in front of the level 10 boss. We'll fight it. We'll then work our way up to level 16. We'll see if we can fight that. And then we'll see what happens 
when you hit a barrier and what comes after. So there you go. So if you guys like what you yeah. saw, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you, Triffin, for being here. Yeah, man, no problem. All right, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.